show is how to train this tree to a, a four litre system. First thing we're going to do is cut this back to the bottom wire, uh, which is approximately at half a metre above the ground, and um, and remove the, the 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 top couple of buds so that we can start to focus on um, forming a, a the, the four litre tree. So we're going to cut it just above the wire, about there. Um, as you can see, there's a clip holding it so that as those shoots grow, it won't flop around. And I'm just going to knock off those um, top buds here because they're the ones that'll be very dominant and also want to go very um, vertical. So now we've knocked all those off. Um, and what will happen now is that these buds, lower down buds here, will start to form our um, four litre system. It's the 15th of December and what I'm going to do now is show you what to do with a tree that we've uh, uh, just snipped back earlier on in September and now we're going to train the four limbs to so that we're creating the four litre system. So I'm just going to walk around there and, and do a little bit of pruning and train the limbs down appropriately. So here we've got our limbs here. What we're going to do is use these two here to go out as our outer two litres. So I'll just put them down like this. I won't put them down, I won't put them down flat. these are very strong, we'll cut them back, it's December so it's okay, uh, I'll cut that back to a couple of buds here, so that will create the middle two, and we'll cut that one back to so that if we need to, we can get some off that as well. So that's it, that's our four litre tree in December, and our two litres here, and we'll get two shoots coming. It's the 2nd of March 2016 and what we're going to show is a follow-up on uh, what to do this time of year. So in this particular tree it's got four litres and uh, pretty well spaced and all I'm going to do is just pull them out a little bit more so that they'll be permanently in place and that's that's where they'll stay forever. So down here we'll just pull this one down a little bit more. basically going to be positioned where this lip here is. Um, pull that one down a little bit more. So that it's nice and vertical. So this shoot will grow next year. You can take off this, this bit here. Back to encourage that. That will just grow. Um, this one here, we can pull it out a bit more. So it's, it's roughly 50 centimeters apart. This one here, same thing. We can pull that one out. Um, of course, these two ones will be the, the dominant leaders. So have them a little bit lower than the other ones. And here we can position where it's going to end up. Basically, you want to end it up there. Maybe pull this one down a little bit more. So that's all we need to do. Basically, we'll have our, our four leaders one, two, three, four, positioned at 50 centimetres apart. Mm -hmm.